Endreams just revealed their brand new upcoming VR game Vendetta Forever at the VR Games Showcase and here I am already with some gameplay for that game. Now let me level with you. I played this game months ago. I was kindly invited to Endreams to check out some of their upcoming projects and this game is the one that really, really stood out to me. I think this could be a lot of people's new favourite VR game. It has the secret sauce. This game has that thing, that feeling. The first time you played Super Hot? Yeah, this feels like that. The first time you played Pistol Whip? Yeah, this feels like that. And those games have gone on to become absolute classics. And I do believe Vendetta Forever has the potential to do the exact same. Now this is a fast paced combat driven game where you play through very short levels. The levels are probably a maximum of like a minute long, maybe a couple of minutes, but in the main game there's going to be tons of them. I don't know the exact number, but here in this demo that I have access to there are five levels and I think the longest one, here we go, target time 1 minute 15, target time 10 seconds, target time 45 seconds. It has a WarioWare element feeling to it. You're meant to blast through these levels quickly, but you are also meant to replay them to get achievements and beat them in a perfect manner. Take no hits, get through it as quick as possible. I can't wait to show you this, it's it's so much fun. It, it kind of is the ultimate John Wick simulator as well. Now over here we have mutators. Now you can activate these to increase or decrease your potential score based on what the mutator is. Some of the mutators make the game easier, some of them make it much harder. Again, much like Beat Saber, much like Pistol Whip, you have things that can tailor your experience. So two examples, you can have Iron Heart here. If I enable that, I am immune to all damage, but that means my score multiplier is knocked down down to 0.25 because it's making the game much easier or I can add iron sights now this disables aim assist on my guns and gives me a 1.5 score multiplier there's things also like trick shot where bullets ricochet and there's a bunch that I haven't unlocked yet right let me get into some gameplay I love this I do believe it will be an absolute favorite for years to come for many VR players I think this could be a huge hit Let's get into it. Let's start with the first level, Neon Vengeance. Okay, Neon Vengeance, blood on the dance floor. My objective is to eliminate the VIP and reach the exit. My target time is 30 seconds. Let me talk you through how this game works as I play the level. Pull trigger to continue. Okay, so it looks very much like Super Hot. You'll probably see that immediately. But in here, the catch is when you kill somebody, you can zip to where their death occurred by grabbing their weapon. So straight away, if I throw this at this guy, I can grab his gun, shoot that guy, grab his gun, shoot that guy, grab his gun, shoot that guy, and you're moving. Wah, bye. Oh, no, I died. It's so good. You are moving by grabbing the weapons of the people you've just killed and you're bouncing through the level like that. Right, let's try this again. I love how you start with a pencil on this level. So brutal, right? Smash him. I killed them both! Oh my god, I went through them both! What in the hell happened there? Blah. Bop, bop, bop. Grab him. There we go. There we go. It's better. Blah. No, no! It has that super hot thing where if you take your eyes off one location, for too long, you are just dead. You have to look everywhere. But it doesn't have the slow down time mechanic of super hot, so you've got to be quick. You've got to be quick. All right, kill him. Oh, man. Grab, 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 grab. Get in. Oh, okay. Okay, that's not worked. He's the life. He's the life. Boss, 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 boss! Kill the boss! We good? Ah! Who are you? Ah, no! No! Oh my god! Ah. Ah. Get into the lift! Oh, okay. That is a level right there. Now, I didn't hit the target time. I was 40 milliseconds over it, which is really, really annoying. 30 seconds and 40 milliseconds. 24 kills. I took 8 damage. So, that wasn't 
super smooth, I took a bunch of damage. But you can see how people who chase scores and want intense VR games would absolutely adore this. Oh man, I love this level, but I died loads playing this when I was testing the demo yesterday. So this is five card stud, read them and weep, kill all enemies. Now the target time for this level is five seconds. <laughs> you will see why. This is the whole level. So there's five enemies and I have a gun. You just have to try and kill them all, I think, without taking a shot. Oh no! <laughs> I missed two of my shots. I've got to go again. Grab the gun, kill the men. Grab the gun, kill the men. Oh! Oh! Was that five seconds? Yes! 4.104. B? B grade's pretty good, but I did take a shot. I'd love to do that level without taking any damage. I might try one more time. Now, one thing to note about this game, I do have the aim assist on. It's on by default. The guns do have a slight bit of aim assist to them, but it isn't that forgiving. It isn't helping me that much because I'm still able to miss these guys from such close range. But you can turn that off, again, by using a mutator that does remove the... There's a gun under the table. Oh my god, there's a gun under the table. Oh, oh it's a... No, it's not a gun. That's... <laughs> what was that? Okay, that was some kind of collectible that I didn't realize even existed. It was a videotape. Right, this might be my favorite level in the demo. Slums. This is awesome. This does feel like a John Wick kind of setup. Reach the exit. No casualties. So don't, don't shoot the good people. I, I love the art style of this game. I think a lot of people will immediately think super hot because of the like white people with that kind of polyagonal look to them. But I think it's deeper than that. It does have its own art style. Superhot's clearly been an influence, don't get me wrong, but there's something about this that, that is just very different and I really like. VR Oasis! How did he get a little tag on the wall? I want a little tag on the wall. A wolf in VR! I want a tag on the wall, this isn't fair. Right, okay, let's try and kill all these people. Bang, 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 bang. Go to that gun there, bang. Oh, he's got knives. Bosh, bosh, bosh. Oh, no. Gun. Oh, missed him. Get him. Did you see it? I'm looking for Blumin. Reach the King. I want a Blumin tag. Q2C VR. I've got to look for my tag. Am I, have I even got a tag? Maybe I don't have a tag. Can't look for something that isn't there. Ah. There, there, there. Get up there. Bang, bang. I'm obsessed with the tags now. If I don't have one, I'm going to cry. I'm gonna cry. Oh, possess me! Oh! 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 Come on. Come on. Oh, I died! I bloody died! Oh, it's brutal. It's so brutal. There's a tag there. Probably isn't me. They, they don't love me enough, I don't reckon, to put me in here. Bloody end dreams. I love them, but they don't love me back. The graffiti on the wall ruined that run because now I'm obsessed with whether I'm in here or not. Bang, 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 bang. Grab that gun. Kill him. Grab the knives. One, two, three. Grab that gun. Grab that. This really is my favorite level so far. It's just awesome. I love this bit where you're climbing up the... There we go. I'm going super slow right now. Oh, super slow mo. Ah, what's that? Substatica. It's not me. It's not me. It's not me. I'm not loved. Gun. Where's the gun? No. There. Bosh. 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 Come on. That wasn't quick necessarily, but it was pretty good. And get him. Yeah. Absolute hero. Absolute hero. All right. 35.78 seconds. That's pretty good. Top 10. 40 kills. 9 damage. Eventually, I will just do all these levels without taking damage. That's my ultimate goal. All right, this one's scary because the target time is only 10 seconds. Uh, Dojo brought a knife to a gunfight. I mean, that's the one thing you don't do. You d oh no! What does this? What does this mean? Block projectiles with the blade. Look at your target. A marker will appear. Pull trigger to teleport to target. Cut. Oh my god. Okay. So I have to. Oh. Okay. This is going to be horrible, isn't it? Right, uh... Start, three, two... What's happened? Oh, I've got two blades. What's happening? Oh, okay. Oh, what's happening? Oh, my... Okay, I don't know what's happening. Ah, ah. 
Ah, ah, okay, I, I, I don't, I don't fully know what's happening there. That one. Let's try that again. Kill him. Oh, no! One more dude. One more dude. No. Oh! It's okay. I had it under control. I had the whole thing under control. Bad time, but that that sword throw at the end was absolutely sublime. So we'll move on. All right, this is the last level of the demo. So this is all I can show you today. This is Gunship. Get to the chopper. This game has tons of movie references. I think that's very intentional. A lot of the levels are homages to action films and things, which is super cool. If you're a bit of a movie nut like me, you'll, you'll spot a lot of stuff, a lot of quotes, a lot of... Uh, kind of parallels that I'm sure you'll really, really enjoy. Hey, look at that. VR Realm. There are more tags in here. It's not just that one level. There's still hope for me yet. Okay, this is a longer level. This is 1 minute 15 seconds. Let's get cracking. Oh, these dudes with armor. Annoy the hell out of me. There we go, up there. Armor, armor, armor. Get there. There we go. What's he got? What is that? That's, oh, um, okay. We are moving. We are moving. This is... Oh, okay. This is cool. I've not played a level like this. I, the whole thing has just changed. The whole thing has just changed. Oh, God. Don't blow that down. Oh, don't blow that down. Who's that? What's that one? Oh, no. Oh, Jesus. Why? That one... I've got too bloody caught up looking at... Bloody... Uh, graffiti again. Okay, that was supposed to crash. That's cool. There we go. Get him, get him, get him, get him, get him. Get him. Get up there. How do I break it? What? I don't know how I break that. VR Italia. Ah, no, I'm dead. I'm dead. I keep, honestly, the bloody graffiti is messing me up. It's, who's is that one up there? Sammy something. Jammy Hero. Love that. Right, let's leave it here. This is Vendetta Forever, and I absolutely adore it. I genuinely do believe this game has modern or next VR classic written all over it. Everyone should pick this up when it comes out. It's just giving me that feeling of the first time I played Superhot, and it's not trying to be Superhot. It is very much its own thing, for sure. But... It still captures that same intense, exciting feeling of Superhot. You know, when Superhot was new, it has that same feeling to it. And I think that's really exciting. I think the last game to get close to that was Pistol Whip. Which again, you know, went on to become oh, a classic within the VR space. I don't know if I'm supposed to be shooting this guy. I feel like I probably am, right? Get that. I mean, is that enough? It's not enough. It's never enough. And then I just die. I don't, <laughs> I don't have to do that level. Maybe I need to be shooting the thing more. Should I be shooting the thing more? I'm going to leave these guys alone. I'm not even going to shoot them. I'm not even going to bother. I think this thing is probably for the chopper. I think that's what this is for, right? This is for the... Ow, he shot me. I think this is for the chopper. Right, just get shooting. Just get bloody shooting. Smoking now. That might have actually done something. Okay. I think that was the right way to do it. Pop him. Get, get, get. Yep, yeah, come on. Come on. No, don't be silly. Don't be silly now. He's gone. Oh, move, move, move. Oh, no. No. There we go. There we go. There we go. Bug off you. Get that again. Get him. Get that right. Double. Yeah, come on now. That's how we do it. That's how we do it. I love this game so much, and I cannot wait to get my grubby little mitts on the full release because it is so bloody good. Hopefully you've enjoyed. If you have, please do leave a like, leave a comment, hit subscribe. Let's start the petition to get my uh, graffiti tag added in here. It probably is in here somewhere. At least I'd like to hope so. <laughs> right, take care, everyone. I'll see you soon for another one. Goodbye.